This is the Sabbath School lesson for the second quarter, 2021. Lesson 12 for June 12 to 18, Covenant Faith, read by Dr. Percy Harold. Thursday, June 17, Resting on the Promises. There is a story told about the famous Cardinal Bellarmine, the great Catholic apologist who all his life fought the message of justification by imputed righteousness alone. As he lay dying, he was brought the crucifixes and the merits of the saints to help give him assurance before death. But Bellarmine said, Take it away. I think it's safer to trust in the merits of Christ. As they near the end of their lives, many people look back and see how vain, how futile, how useless their deeds and their works are for earning salvation with a holy God, and thus how much they need the righteousness of Christ. Yet the good news is that we don't have to wait for the approach of death to have security in the Lord. The whole covenant is based on the secure promises of God now, promises for us now, promises that can make our lives better now. Look up the following verses and answer the question asked with each one in the context of developing, keeping and strengthening your covenant relationship with God. First of all, Psalm 34 Verse 8, how can you taste God's goodness? O oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who trusts in him. Matthew 11.30, what has Christ done for us that makes this yoke easy? For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. And Romans 5.1, what does justification have to do with peace? Therefore, having been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. And Philippians 2, verses 7 and 8. What have you gained from Christ's experience? Philippians 2, verse 7. But made himself of no reputation, taking the form of a bondservant, and coming in the likeness of men, and being found in appearance as a man, he humbled himself and became obedient to the point of death, even the death of the cross. So to finish the day, prayerfully examine your life and ask yourself, what things am I doing that are strengthening my relationship with God and what things are hurting it? What changes do I need to make? This lesson was read by Dr. Percy Harold for Christian Services for the Blind. It's supported by the Sabbath School Department and Hope Channel Australia and is rebroadcast by Christian Record Services and through podcasts at It Is Written in the United States, Hope Channel Germany and through Apple iTunes and SoundCloud. Remember, God is always faithful.